Hey guys, this is Canadian Sky Gaming making a review or tutorial of how to create a. Well, this is as you see here, I'm doing a texture pack right now, but it is actually to show you guys how to create um, or paste one picture over another on PaintNet because it, it doesn't work the same way on Paint. Uh, for example, if you want to go to. Oh, sorry. If you go to open. And you want to choose something like that. Well, by the way, I'm making a texture pack right now. And then when you open it, that's what it looks like. And you can't you can't paste that over here, unfortunately. And I'm gonna actually put this texture pack, uh, upload it one one day. But um, yeah. So uh, then you go to uh, since you can't, you actually have to go to open. Look for the item you want to use. Uh, so. I'm trying to make a sword that I made one, I have to redo it. So you look for it, you find the sword. Now this texture pack is copied and redone. And uh, what it, the problem is, is I'm trying to fix it because it's not really working. So you copy it and you have to copy it. And now click this pasteboard thing and it will go over. Now, uh, unfortunately I made a mistake. Uh, I don't think I can fix. Uh, let's see. Okay, I can fix it. Okay. So you just scroll this over. Uh, it's not here. Oh, let's try to just paste it again. Okay, there we go. And then just, this is diamond sword color, so you just color that over. Now, this originally was a wooden sword, and um, I did it once. You don't want to do it again. You just recolor it to make it a diamond sword. And uh, once you have that done, you just save it. So you go save. So anyways, this was a really quick tutorial of how to paste a picture over another picture. And also showing you guys that I'm actually making a tutorial. Or not a tutorial, but a texture pack video. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video of how to create a or double a picture but put it on the same file and i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys